welcome to javascript talks today i'm going to talk about the conditional breakpoint feature in vs code so when we debug our application we often put a breakpoint just by clicking on the line number then if we launch the application using our vs code's debug feature we hit the breakpoint so this breakpoint is just a common breakpoint but there is one useful feature called conditional breakpoint so instead of just clicking on the line number if you right click on it you can find add conditional breakpoint feature so at first i'll talk about what it does sometimes we need to hit the breakpoint only when certain conditions are met suppose in this example i have an array and we are iterating that array using the map function and then uh, suppose when the item is the second one like the item number two only that time we want to hit a breakpoint we want to pause the execution now one way to do that is just uh, have a breakpoint here and then when the browser hits the breakpoint the first item is one then you resume the call and then go to the second one you can do that for smaller arrays but suppose you have a number of items like 100 items you want to pause the program when the item count is let's say 50 then how do you do that so that is where you should use conditional breakpoint to add one conditional breakpoint just right click on the line number and then click on conditional breakpoint then you can add your condition like i have the item that is a number so i can write items equals to two and whenever the item equals to two it will hit the breakpoint and if you hover over the breakpoint you can see the condition so i'm going to restart i'm going to refresh the browser and see what happens now, now the execution has been paused here and if i hover over item i can see that item number is two that means this breakpoint has been added conditionally this is a very useful feature and not only in vs code you can use the same feature in chrome debugger as well so here i have opened the chrome debugger here also if you right click and then add condition breakpoint this time i'm adding item equals to three and then hit enter now if i refresh the page I can see that the execution has been paused and the item value is 3. So from now on, start using this feature. This is very very useful. If you like this video, please hit like and subscribe for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.